Hello everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel or welcome to my YouTube channel. I'm Call Me Chris and you can call me Chris. I don't know why I'm talking like a radio host. That could be a character. I will keep that in the back of my noggin. Anyway, today we are watching um, blind dating six men based off of their outfits, which is, if that was the case for me, if somebody had to date me based off of what my outfit is or choose to date me based off of what my outfit is, I would be single for the rest of my life, which is, well, hopefully that's just never the case because I am always dressed like I'm about to eat an extra large pizza, a pint of ice cream, and that I'm about to watch the Lord of the Rings movies and Hobbit movies back to back at all times. All right, I have the nice top on, right? I'm wearing the baggiest sweatpants there is to mankind and knee high socks, okay? It's not cute. This up, kind of cute. This down, it's not good. Also, I forgot to say, um, your smile, it's so cute. <laughs> it warms my heart, it does. I love it, you're just so pretty. Your lips and your teeth and it's, I love it. AM ASMR channel, ADHD moment. Okay, let's get into the video. Okay, six versus one dating men based on outfits. We asked Jess to speed date six men. She must pick one date based on his outfit and personality. Personality is good, personality is key. I wouldn't really care what a, what a guy or girl wears, to be honest. I'm not much of like a fashion lease, if you can't tell. So this wouldn't really matter to me. I'm more of a personality person, to be honest. Also, in what, why is she, look at this girl. <laughs> this is illegal. She's. Stunning. Where did they find her? She looks like, she looks like Mulan and Pocahontas had a love child and it's just. <sighs> anyway, she's stunning, okay? None of these men deserve her. Let's keep going. Hi, I'm Jess. Hi Jess. I'm 21. 21. So I only. God, I'm getting old. I'm 25. Oh, she's like a child. Never mind. I started getting into fashion really like my senior year of high school. She looks I had to buy all my own clothes, so I got oh. really into thrifting. I look <gasps> love thrifting. Okay, we love a thrifty bitch. Let's go. Time as an environmental consultant. Aww. And then right now I'm studying for the LSAT so I can apply to law school. So she's an angel. She's a smart, smart fashionista angel. Can I date her? Is that a thing? Can I Can I be behind that curtain? She'd be like, no. Who's that janky ass hoe with her long socks and her white sweatpants with five stains on them? Out. <laughs> Boards is like. Tyler the Creator, kind Ooh. of. If a guy can pull off a suit, I'm also very into that Ooh, too. Fair enough. Maybe into grunge, but also mm. business casual. That would be the perfect man. Okay, that's fair. That's fair. That's fair. Oh, okay, so they show the shoes first. Ooh. Okay, cool. Ooh, we got some like Jordans. In we got some they're probably like loafers. The last thing I, think I don't know what those are. To an outfit, but they Conver say they some dirty ass Converse. Look at those. Look, both of them. That's like off white Converse. These look like yellow and nasty. Like they fell into the toilet. And then these ones look like they were thrown away and he found them in a trash can. But then he only cleaned the outside of these rims. What is that? And these pants are too short. He should cuff them. What are you doing? Maybe I'm into this. Okay, here we go. The most about someone from my shoes. Oh, these guys. Okay, these shoes are okay. Okay, contestant number two. I like those shoes a lot. Okay, now that I'm looking at them, I just don't like the off white, you know? It just like looks old. Are those shoes? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Also, um, contestant number four does look nice. I'm curious what's gonna accompany Snazzy. the rest of those. I can't really tell yeah. too much off the bat. So, what kind of music is everyone into? Ooh, good question. Uh, favorite genre is probably like rap, like Kanye. Do his shoes say rap? What does his shoes say? Rape? <laughs> what do they say? Bap? Vape? Rap? Vape? If anybody vapes. <laughs> Oh, out. Oh, okay, not cute. Okay, he likes rap. I also listen to like pop, like Ariana Grande, like a hundred gecks. Oh. I'm a producer. I make oh. a lot of music from different genres. He's a producer. Okay, I think she's vibing with number two right now. I'm voting for number two so far. I think from like reggae to hip hop to house music. I'm a big R&B guy. 30 Shoes is R&B, all right. To mix it up with alternative music as well. Alternative, yeah, you alternative, all right. You alternative nasty, that's what you are. A lot of indie rock. My favorite bands are Sad Girl and uh, a band called Maxiel. So <laughs> she's like, I don't know who the that is, but okay. Like old corny music, like Frank Sinatra, Dean Martin. Oh, yeah, you can tell by the shoes. He likes, I like that. I love older music, Frank Sinatra, like Elvis, all those, Bing, Bing Crosby, blah, 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 blah. Okay, cool. I like Fancy Shoe Boy. Rolling Stones and favorite artist, Otis Red. Ooh, we could see, wait, wait, no, go back. Wait, I'm visualizing. We see, I'm really gonna analyze this. Okay, we see like the little little uh, fray on the pants there. I think he's a little bit more grunge, which she was into. I kind of like that. Don't get the shoes. He looks like he stole them off of a dead body, but I think I vibe with this, okay? Otis Redding. Otis Redding, I like nice. Thundercat and Prince. Prince is obviously the best musician of all time. Is he though? Prince is good. I like Prince, but he's not the 
the best. He's got Jordans and then he's got some like Renaissance socks. Some Jordans and Renaissance socks. I don't know. I'm excited to see what the f this guy's wearing. I feel like he's he's just like colors, like all different colors. You know what I'm saying? You know, there's that. Okay, let me, okay. Let me go back. Elimination okay. round. Okay, who's she gonna eliminate? Yeah, go I think she's gonna eliminate Dirty She Boy, Dirty Converse She Boy. To eliminate, very sadly, Contestant number one. Oh! Oh no! Is he really attractive? <gasps> Let's see. Oh, he's so cute! Oh, I love his jacket! I want that jacket. He's so cute. He's got a little band-aid on his face. Did he cut himself? Oh no, and he's got a little earring. Oh my gosh, girl! Your outfit is amazing, though. You I too, love you it. Too. Thank you. <laughs> what happened to your face? Oh, it's just Nelly inspired. Oh, oh, okay. It's for fashion? Are people putting band-aids on their face for fashion? What the f is it? What was I missing? Actually, that, I love that because if I have a giant like Mount Everest zit on my face, I can just slap a band-aid on it and just be like, fashion icon, yes. There's like 12 band-aids on my face. <laughs> well, this is cool. Aw, okay, cute, cute. I think, I, I don't think they would have been good together, so I'm okay with that. Ooh, we got to see more. Oh, see, oh, the guy in the end. Look at the guy, look at this guy in the end. What did I tell you? I said color and he is flamboyant color. I'm kind of into it though. Uh, yeah, okay. This guy's looking swaggy. Fancy shoes is looking swaggy. Dead person guy shoes, he's looking grunge, like I said. Dirty Converse is looking better on the top. His jeans are too small for him though. He's, it's like he's had those for like five years and he's just really attached to them. And then first guy, new first guy, guys that like the shoes. I like those pants. I'm still voting for the, uh, the, the, the first one now. Ooh. Okay. Contestant number five is not what I was expecting at all. It was what I was expecting. I don't know. I, I just genius. expected him first to be wearing like pants or like nah. something more athletic. Nah, I'm digging I like it though. I'm digging it. I like it. the colors a lot. Me too. I'm very into it. Contestant number three is kind of what I expected. I also liked his music choices yes. too. So yes. Very promising. Yep. He's wearing like a swaggy jacket. I like that. A swanky jacket. Where would we go on our first date Ooh. and what would we be doing? Good question. Definitely I will tell you. I will tell you what we would do on our first date they're just okay let me tell you this okay first date picture this all right okay you and me we're on a first date okay i take you out to the nicest fast food restaurant there is okay mcdonald's okay everybody loves mcdonald's we're at mcdonald's i get you chicken nuggets milkshake whatever you want i treat you okay and then we go to the movie theaters okay we go to the movie theaters we watch the best movie any movie you want i don't care you want to watch a rom-com cool you want to watch a horror movie better because i like horror movies you want to watch a documentary cool i like that a david attenborough documentary something like that whatever doesn't matter we watch a movie okay and then i take you home. I give you a little peck on the cheek and I say good night. Okay, that's our day. Good, good, good. Okay, let's see what these men have to say. And what would we be doing? Definitely love to go on a drive. I like his Probably pants. somewhere like near the coast, you know, get that like nice ocean breeze. Afterwards, I would love to like show you some of my music and maybe cook you something if you're done. Ooh. Ooh, I like that. I like that. Music scares me a little bit. I don't know what he's doing with the music, but that's cool. I'm down. Okay, cool. Um, I like to go out to like overlooks and- I like his jacket. I like the brown jacket, but this is tight pants boy. I like his rings too. Okay. And cliffs and just kind of like watch the stars or just, just uh, chill in the car and then talk and like we'll really get to know you. You want to chill in the car on a cliff? What are you going to murder her? What are you, a serial killer? That doesn't sound good. I wouldn't want that as a first date, like to just hang out in the car. There's just like too much room for shenanigans. You know what I'm saying? I'm abstinent, so I wouldn't know, but you know what I'm saying? So for me, I consider myself like a big romantic. Definitely for sure. gonna take you out to dinner. Maybe a place I haven't tried before or somewhere that I know that's really good. Dinner's maybe nice. Go, like dancing or... What kind oh. of dancing would we do? Like swing dancing? Oh! Or dancing? I can do a little salsa, just a little bit. Oh! So. You did some... Look at his little feet go. It's not very good. He's an old soul, which is really sweet. I like that. I like that a lot. I'd probably take you for a ride out to my favorite spot on... Uh, Angel's Crest Highway. Oh. And we probably would have a picnic there and- Picnic? After then uh, an art museum. Oh, she likes picnics. What would you drive us to Art museum. A motorcycle if- Ooh, I'm a sucker for motorcycles. Fun fact about me, I can drive motorcycles. I don't have one. I used to, but I don't. I need to get one, but I have my license. That's cool. Yeah, I've never been on the back of a motorcycle actually. Ooh, There's she likes it. First. He's so grunge. I would choose a drive-in movie. I drive a truck, <gasps> so I love drive -in I've movies. got a pretty impressive drive-in movie setup. Aww. Air mattress, blankets, pillows. Air mattress, blankets, shenanigans, shenanigans. We're not Netflix and chilling on the first night, okay? We need to be gentlemen, okay? Gentlemans. I still like the shorts though. Preferably a horror movie if you're into that. <gasps> I love him. Can I have him? He's so colorful and like horror movies and has a truck, but I, I'm gonna sit like far. <laughs> I love like horror movies. movies. Mm. Oh, elimination. <gasps> Who's she gonna eliminate? Okay, I think. Dirty shoe, skinny pants boy. Dirty shoe, oh, skinny pants boy. I only had one. 
Okay. Dirty, dirty shoes, skinny pants boy. Dirty mm -hmm. shoes, skinny pants Confession boy. Dirty shoes. Dirty shoes, kid. Yes. Yes. What does he look like? What does he look like? What does he look like? What does he look Hi. like? Oh, I love him. Uh, wait, <laughs> he's so cute. Oh, I like his bandana. Wait. Oh, I love him. And his glasses. <gasps> now I feel bad. I really like his jacket, though. I want that jacket. Why do I want every guy's jacket? I have so many dude jackets. Yeah, I would like his jacket. He's got a cute face. Nice smile, too. Okay, that's unfortunate. Nice to meet you. I'm sorry, your answer no, you're is just not as dramatic. I'm Jess. Yeah, it was the answer. It's okay. Yeah. All right. He took that hard. He was like, yeah, whatever. Okay, maybe I don't like him. He's not nice. It's going to be contestant number two. Oh, she had to eliminate two. Oh, I, you know what? He would have been my second guess just because he's like such an old soul and she seems more contemporary and stuff. I want to see what he looks like though. Oh, he's so cute. That's almost like, that's like exactly what I was picturing. Look at, he's got like the mullet thing going on, that shirt. I'd like that jacket as well. Do they have their numbers or their, like their contact information? I just, just would, I hit him up. Just be like, hey, can I have your jacket, please? I'm it's Sam, snazzy. I love your you. outfit so much Thank you, though. I appreciate it. And about the sustainable fashion, I work at mm -hmm. a thrift store. Really? Yeah, so uh, like, That would have been a power couple. I feel these three. Feeling really good about the first one still, about, about off-white Converse boy. I feel like the tops definitely match the pants. I still oh my god, his top is so, you have really cool so dramatic. Oh There's God. Mary, <laughs> Jesus's mom on his shirt. Represent, oh, represent, all right. Motorcycle. I love, the rock music. love a leather jacket. Now. I like the other guy's top too. I like it's like loose. It's cool. Oh, nothing about me. I, I mean, <laughs> <laughs> it looks I like him. He's got like this bad boy swag about him. This guy, the first guy. I'm picking the first guy. I see maybe a little bit Sticking of a with that. I like that. Where do you see yourself in five years? I am leaving in about six months oh. uh, to Asia. I'm starting a business project in the Philippines with my friend. We are oh. developing affordable housing oh. for pretty much anyone around the world to be able to vacation. So I'm he's an angel. To, you know, make it more accessible for people to be able to visit. He wins, I think. Oh, that's a great idea. That's great, wow. Yeah, that's super sweet, wow. I like that. <laughs> but he's leaving. Probably tattooing and trailing at the same time. Currently, I'm doing a tattoo apprenticeship down in OC. Cool, Hopefully tattooing, that that's awesome. Give me She's like artsy. To travel and work at the same time. All right, you cool. Look at the guy in the end, he's like warming up. He's like, I'm about to blow this bitch's mind. She ain't even know, these boys don't even know. <laughs> I'm excited to hear his answer. What was your first tattoo? Well, what got me into tattooing was art in general, and mm -hmm. I've been drawing all my life. I have a degree in fine arts. Oh, I just cool. figured that's a way to make money and do what I love. Yeah. And first tattoo, Fair enough. I was 17, and it was in New York City, and I got a skull on the inside of my skull. bicep. Classic. Do you not have any tattoos right now? I do not have any tattoos either, and I don't know if I will ever get one because I have commitment issues, yeah. In multiple ways. <laughs> I'll get piercings though all the time. Hey, wait, I have an idea. This video gets to 100,000 likes. I shouldn't say this. If this video gets to 150,000 likes, you guys can choose my next piercing. Jesus, I'm gonna regret that. Okay, it's gonna happen though. I'm pretty stationary compared to everybody else, I suppose. I would like to I like either open up my own dealership or oh. start brokering out cars personally. Cars are my passion, so. Cool. What's your dream car? Ooh, that's a hard, that's, I'm a big Mercedes-Benz guy. I worked for them for about Mercedes, four years. Cool. So maybe, I would say maybe an SLS Gullwing. Oh, oh, who's she gonna eliminate? I think she's gonna eliminate, oh, final elimination. I think it's gonna be Leather Jacket Boy, the colored shirt guy. I think the first person I'm gonna eliminate is Leather. contestant number two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I knew it, I'm so good at this. What does he look like? What does he look like? Jess, nice to meet Mara. you. Oh, he looks sick. Oh, he's handsome. He's so cute. He looks exactly like what I thought he would look like. Oh, he's got the earring too. These guys got swag. These got a good group of guys. Good group of guys. Mara. He looks sweet. Nice you. I like your jacket. Thank you. I like your Oh, he's looking at me. He's like, I like your jacket. You want a tattoo? <laughs> I'll tattoo you. Okay, never mind. Cute. It's gonna be the first guy. And I said that. I said it from the start. We can get a replay on that when I said it. I'm picking the first guy. I'm picking the first guy. I'm picking the first guy. I said, it's gonna be off-white shoe boy. Whatever the f I said, I don't remember what I said, but it's gonna be that guy. Give me 30 seconds. Give me 30 seconds. I know <laughs> it. I know it. really tough. <laughs> I like both their outfits in different ways. Uh, so now I gotta think back to the answer. And now they're friends. Now they're friends. Both. Both. 
Both? Gonna, Can you do both? Eliminate contestant number two. Yep. I knew it! I'm so sad about it though. <laughs> I knew it. It's all good. What does he look like? Hi, I'm Jess. <gasps> nice to meet you, Jess. Quinn. Oh, he's cute too. I like his hat. His hat matches everything. But I'm really excited to see this first guy. This guy looks so cute though. He looks really sweet. These guys are taking it really hard. Like, it's, this is like a game show thing. They're just like, their egos are... <laughs> We're excited. Oh, what does he look like? Hey, I'm Jess. Oh, he looks sick. I feel like their vibe is really similar, you know? Yeah, I'm He's got the nose really ring. I'm excited about what you're doing in the future with sustainable oh, fashion. Oh, thank you. It's I liked really what cool you were going to do, like your plan for five years. I'm like holding my nose because he has a nose awesome. ring. I think it was your first date. I like his hair. His hair is cool too. He's got earrings too. Everybody's pissed. Why is everybody pissed? I like that. I like piercings. <gasps> and you guys are going to pierce me soon because it's going to get to 150,000 likes. Tell everybody in the comments to like the video so you can do that and then also tell me what kind of piercing you want me to get i don't know why i'm talking in this accent i don't even know what kind of accent this is really okay let's 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 hear the end oh. she's tall i think there's definitely like a lot of elements that she's i so pretty. do like the jewelry i've never gone for before but i kind of like it glad i'm spicing it up yeah, you are yeah. Spicing <laughs> he's got like the bottom grill too he seems so sweet I mean, let's get married. Uh, let's get married. Oh my God. Okay. Okay. I loved that. I don't, that was so fun. That was so fun to watch. I am a genius and I knew she was going to pick him because I'm just trying to have great taste. I mean, she should have picked me, but that's fine. I won't take it to heart. If she sees this video though, my number is, um, I will send it to you. <laughs> anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you get this video to 150,000 likes, I will uphold that because I, I'm true to my word. Also, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Please like the video. If you like the video, it does really help the channel. Please sub if you're not already subbed. I know a lot of you aren't subscribed, which is a crime. It's a crime and I'm coming to your house and I'm gonna arrest you, okay? Not in that way. Don't be nasty, okay? Also, hit that little notification bell to know when I post my next video and I will see you in the next video, okay? Love you, bye.